Hi, I'm Oscar Hillstrom and welcome to The Sci-Fi Show, which is great if you really love sci-fi. If you don't, sadly, you've come to the wrong place. One of the coolest things about covering science fiction is when science fact starts creeping into that kind of territory. The good people at the Karolinska Institute in Stockholm in Sweden have in fact grown a human windpipe from the stem cells of the person who was to receive that new windpipe after they had a tracheotomy. Swedes grow stem cells by the seashore. Yes, it's really disturbing, Ugh! but at the same time, kind of awesome, because this kind of organ replacement has been part of science fiction history for years. Drilling holes in his head's not the answer. The artery must be repaired. We can rebuild him. We have the technology. -da 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 -da. Now, J.J. Abrams thinks he's pretty cool at hyping up his movies, but he's got nothing on Chris Nolan who has stuck to the most perfect strategy of giving people absolutely nothing until they're about ready to burst. He unleashed this piece of work, the new teaser trailer for The Dark Knight Rises. If you make yourself more than just a man, if you devote yourself to an ideal, then you become something else entirely, a legend, Mr. Wayne, a legend. We were in this together. And then you were gone. Now there's evil rising. The bad man has to come back. What if he doesn't exist anymore? He must. One of the coolest things about watching Star Trek The Next Generation growing up in the 80s was thinking one day that all, all this replicator stuff, stuff would be reality. Sadly, that hasn't been the case until now. The 3D printer is a reality. It's not actually a replicator because, you know, we don't have access to billions of gigawatts. What the hell is a gigawatt? It's going to be the next big thing in manufacturing. They have a power that then becomes a plasticine object and then literally becomes a reality. Although, if it's anything like a normal printer, I can't help but think how expensive the cartridges are going to be. Bastards. In prequel of a remake of a remake of a remake news, The Things trailer has been unleashed upon the world. It's clobbering time. If you're a big fan of Joel Edgerton playing a Norwegian scientist, just before he gets killed by an alien from outer space, then this is the movie for you, as Ulrik Thompson leads a hapless team of Norwegian scientists trying to deal with the most hideous, shape-changing alien of all time, even though we all know what's going to happen. I think this thing copies its prey and then hides inside it. What are you saying? Not all of us are human. It could be any of us. Not a good time to lose one's head. Oh, indeed. That's not the way to get ahead in life. No. It's a shame he wasn't more headstrong. Mm. He'll never be the head of a major corporation. Okay, that'll do. Okay. 